Hey, what's up guys? It's Murders here bringing you my second GIMP tutorial. Now, in my first GIMP tutorial, I showed you guys how to uh, use the smart scissors, intelligent scissors, and how to cut an image out from a background or uh, an image from another image. So if you want to go back to my page and watch that first tutorial and learn how to use this tool, the smart scissors, you feel free to do that before you watch this one. Um, this video, what we're going to do is after you've taken an image out with smart scissors, you're left with a bit of rough edges here and there, you know, from the background. So in this video, I'm going to be teaching you how to clean up these edges nice and sharp, nice and smooth. You're not going to see any of that stuff anymore. It's going to be perfect. So let's hop right into it. We're going to go, we're going to go up to layers. Okay. And we're going to go to transparency and then we're going to go down to alpha two selection. Click that. And then you're going to see now we've got, now we've got our image selected. This lines around it. Okay. See, you can see this image as uh, the lines around the image now. So now we're going to go up to select and we're going to go to shrink. And, um, Okay, so you can see pixels, it's doing it by pixels. Make sure this is unchecked, shrink from Im image from border, uncheck that. And um, yeah, two, two pixels seems like a good place to start. And what it's gonna do, it's gonna bring this dotted line in, it's gonna bring it in a little bit. So here we go, we're gonna click okay. Okay, all right, it brought it in a little bit. You can see how it's in a little bit. We might need to do a little more, but for now, it's in for now it's good okay so let's go to now we're gonna go like this we're gonna hit select we're gonna hit invert now that's gonna invert the selection to the black stuff on the outside and then we're gonna go to edit we're gonna go clear boom just like that okay you can see it cleaned it up let me take this selection off select none you can see it cleaned it up a little bit, but not enough. We're going to have to do more pixels. So same thing. Transparency. Doo, doo, doo. We're going to go at alpha to selection. It's going to give us uh, the selection, the dotted lines around the image. Then we're going to go over here to select, shrink. And I got a lot of black stuff, so I'm going to do three. Let's go three. Let's get it done in this one. Okay, so now we're going to go to invert, and then we're going to go edit, and we're going to go clear. Boom. So now you can see it's even less black stuff, okay? There's still a little bit left, and um, I don't want to leave it like that. So just for the sake of the video... I'm going to go through it one more time and I'm going to clean up this last little black spot for you guys. I'll just do it really quickly. Layer, transparency, alpha 2 selection. Now we have it selected. Now we're going to go to select, shrink. Let's do it by 2. 2 will do it for us here. Okay. We're going to go to select, invert. Then we're going to go to edit. And we're going to go clear. Awesome. Then we're going to go select none. And there you go. Now you can see the outside. It's awesome. It's totally clean. It's sharp. And um, you know what? If When I used the intelligent scissors during the tutorial, I went really fast. So if you slow down and take your time with the intelligent scissors... You won't have much stuff to clean up around the edge. I had to shrink that a lot, that image a lot. You usually won't have to do that. So, all right, guys, I hope you enjoyed my, my tutorial. I hope you learned, learned something. And you can use this shrink feature in so many different um, ways. Like, it'll be such a useful tool to know how to do that. So please watch the tutorial again, test it out. And uh, just, I just want to let you guys know this GIMP program, it's 100% free. 
I got the newest game program. It's 2.8.22, 100% free. Just search it up on YouTube. You'll be able to down on Google. I mean, you'll be able to find the website and download it. Okay, guys, this is Murders. Thank you for watching. Please hit like. Please leave a question, comment, and if you want to see more videos, hit that sub button. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll catch you on the next video.